Hi, my name is Doug Goldstein. I'm the director of Profile Investment Services. We help people who live outside the United States handle their U.S. brokerage accounts in the United States. We're based in Jerusalem, Israel, and many of our clients really enjoy the NetX Investor, which allows them to view their accounts online. If you're a first-time user of NetX Investor, this brief video is going to show you how to get started. For starters, just go to the website profile-financial.com and you'll get to our homepage. And when you get to the home page, click on the upper right corner on the green button that says account lookup. Once you get to the NetX Investor account lookup page, it's going to ask you for little information. So where it says lookup, you need to put in PRX. That is the symbol for our office. If you are not a client of our office, you'll just put in the three digits, the three letters that your brokerage firm has given you. Then you put in the user ID number that we gave you, as well as the password. You can click on the button that says, remember user ID, so that you will not have to enter your user ID every time you log into the, into the account. Next, once you click continue, you're gonna to get to this page where it's gonna ask you to reset your password. We're going to give you an original password, but then you have to set up a new one. So this is where you will enter the new password. Make sure it is a really, really secret password, not something very obvious, and don't use the same password that you're using for other institutions or, or other websites. This actually is a very important and uh, hopefully very secret website that you'll be using. So we, we take security very seriously. If for some reason you forget your password, you will be locked out and you'll have to contact our office to get started again if the forget password system doesn't work for you. So you enter the new password, memorize it, and then click continue. And you're going to have to do a security email setup. So we're going to require that we are able to send you emails. So you're going to have to um, get, to this, get to this screen and select an email address and then click continue. And we're gonna send you a one-time passcode. We recommend that people choose email in order to get their one-time passcode. It usually works the easiest for our clients. So select email here, and then it's gonna ask you to put in an email address, which you can, you, you, hopefully your email address will appear here. You can also give a nickname to your device. In this case, if you're using it at home, you could call it home or office if you have more than one device that you're using and then click on the word verify. Once you click on verify, wait a minute or two or three maybe and you'll get an email that's sent to you and it's going it's going to have a code simply plug in the code into this box. Go ahead then and click verify. And once it's verified, it shows you here you can see the the green it says in green verified. And then it's going to ask you, remember my device in the middle here? Remember my device? And you can click on yes if you're using your home computer or your business computer. If you're using a public device, then click no. And then at that point, you'll be able to log in and see your account. We have other videos and other training to teach people how to use these systems. But this is what's important to get started using the NetX system. If you had any problem, go ahead and re review this video. And as always, you can feel free to call our office if you need anything. Our contact details are at the bottom of our website or at the top. You can click on contact and you can find the phone number and, uh, and you can also fill in a form here or simply send us an email if you have any questions or concerns. Thanks very much for watching.